Shining Star. It'll be the January Shining Star. Ooh. And that will go to Jamie Crowder. There you go. Well, let me read it. Let me read it to you. It says, Jamie, is it Kroger or Kroger? Kroger. Jamie Kroger has spent the majority of her professional career at Good Samaritan as a social worker. She offered day treatment services through the Samaritan Center for many years. Several years ago, she joined the GSH hospice team as the bereavement services and volunteer coordinator. Jamie always displays a positive attitude, has a strong work ethic, and is a team player. She displays all of the core pride values with patients and co-workers alike. Jamie's most endearing quality is that she's a compassionate listener. She has gently impacted many spouses and other family members who have experienced the loss of a loved one. When Jamie arrived at hospice, the grief support group was nearly non-existent. With her calm, steady pace and efforts at outreach, she has expanded the grief and healing support group, renaming the group Good Grief and using the Charlie Brown theme. She's encouraged participants to express the loss and loneliness they face, as well as allowing them to laugh, share good memories, and talk about their loved ones' lives. Jamie patiently guides grieving persons at each uh, grieving persons as each moves through the loss process at his or her own pace. There are several large tasks Jamie coordinates each year. The annual Light Up a Life service in the fall, the annual Spring Memorial service, Camp Mikey, the annual Children's Grief Camp, and many mailings for birthday and anniversary memorials. She also writes a quarterly newsletter sent to all families who have lost a loved one in the past year. Jamie coordinates the volunteers who prepare all the mailings for the above events. Can you believe Jamie also makes time to call family members who have lost a loved one recently? It's obvious to this author that Jamie is selfless and a very giving person. In 2022, Jamie also picked up many extra tasks for several months when another social worker moved to PRN status, while a new full-time person was being sought. In 2023, Jamie and several of her hospice colleagues started a caregiver support group for those providing care for family members. The group meets monthly and helps caregivers encounter support and guidance while they learn from one another as well as the professional staff who attend. It seems a very fitting consider uh, it seems very fitting to consider Jamie <clears throat> for the shining star during well this was initially in November during National Hospice Month this year's theme is courageous conversations and Jamie has lovingly had many of those with our hospice families and it says well there's another written comment it says oh forgot she was on the service excellence team in 2021 22 she does so much uh, and that was submitted by Beth Nordker Oh. So, 